Hi everyone, it's Artem from Valor Jewelry and today I'm going to show you how we create all these beautiful chains like this. Let's go! So, welcome to our manufacturing. And everything starts with fine silver. So how we make all these beautiful chains? This is silver and gold chains and I will explain you about the silver one. We basically take the fine silver, which is uh, recyclable, and mix it with special alloy that contains uh, cuprum and zinc. What is 9 to 5 silver? Because mostly chains made of uh, 9 to 5 silver. It's alloy, which means it contains 92.5% of pure silver and 7.5% of alloy, which is cuprum and zinc. Together it's 100% should be. For example, if you want to make this chain, like it's 20 grams, enter style chain, 21 grams, this means that we need to take 20 grams, 25 grams, yeah? For example, 25 grams. We need to take 92.5% of silver, which is 23.2 approximately grams, and 7.5% of cuprum plus zinc which is approximately 1.7 gram. So to make this chain, we need to measure 92.5% of pure silver and add alloy to get to 25 grams in finished product. And then melt it and uh, mix it. Let's go and show you. So now we need to make it liquid and mix it. Let's go to our casting room. Pasha, can you please make, make this away for us? Now we take this piece of metal, now it's 9 to 5 silver and we need just to wash it and dry it and that's all, let's go. Now we will make a chain, now with this metal we just need to make a chain. Now we need to prepare this piece of metal and we will make a wire with it. Thank you. So now we need to stretch it and we will make a wire using this tool.
we need to repeat it a few hundred of times uh, to get this type of the wire and then we can go to this tool and sometimes we need to use a little wire And we need to use fire to make the metal a little bit of so a little bit softer. Thank you, Andrix. So, and we need to repeat it a few more times uh, until the wire. until um, the diameter of the wire will be like we need 1.2 millimeters uh, like this so and the next step we need to make these little circles yeah. uh, with this wire so we need to use this tool And the next step, we need to properly cut it. Okay. So after the cutting all the circles, uh, we need to adjust them and we will solve it. So and we attach all the links one by one to make them in the solid, big solid chain. We get all this chain. So as you can see the shape of the chain uh, it became a bit square and we need to get this, this kind of final product. This one is after polishing and all the process. To make this chain more square shaped we need to do this thing a couple of times. And the next step, we need to grind it a little bit. So the next step, we need to put the chain 
to the special solution which contains sulfur and sulfur contacts with the copper in this alloy and reacts and you can see that the chain Voilà. And the next uh, and almost the final step is polishing. So we need to make this bracelet chain uh, highly polished and shine. So and now you can see how the chain became beautiful and shine. And after the polishing, we need to clean it in ultrasonic bath. The first we put it in this solution with ammonia for a couple of minutes. And let's wait like four or five minutes or so. Now you can see how all the dirt, all the polishing stuff separated. And you can see how, how it shines. And we just need to wash it, just to wash it with a regular water and just dry it. And now we have all this perfect it's a piece of chain or bracelet. It's clean and shiny. So this is how we create all these beautiful chains using silver from the, just a piece of metal to the finished, polished, perfect product. Also, all these chains we make in gold uh, by, by customer request. Uh, all these chains are available on our website, marvel.jewelry, uh, for retail and wholesale as well. Uh, check the link in the description.